Welcome to my channel I aim to upload these news top 10 summaries daily. Links to all articles in the description if one grabs your attention. From Metro under the main headline of Lewis Hamilton explains disastrous Saudi Arabian display and apologizes. Summary of headline article. It was a disaster for Lewis Hamilton in qualifying. Picture. Joe Portlock. Formula One. Formula One via Getty Images. Lewis Hamilton will start the Saudi Arabian Grand Prix 16th on the grid after suffering a disastrous qualifying session. Lewis Hamilton struggled to find the balance in his car during qualifying. Picture. Eric Alonso. Getty Images. Speechless. That's just staggering. Button said about Hamilton's early exit. Just one-tenth quicker than Albon in P17. So that's a massive disappointment for Lewis. I thought that if anyone could do it on a last lap. Five laps in. It's Lewis Hamilton. More. Lewis Hamilton among four drivers who led Saudi Arabia meeting as stars disagree over race going. Ahead more. F1 Marshall quits Saudi Arabian GP over disgusting Lewis Hamilton crash tweet for more stories like this. Check our sport page. From the sun under the main headline of Kane equals Sir Bobby Charlton's goals record after scoring. Winner. Summary of headline article. Harry Kane moved above Gary Lineker in the all-time England goalscoring record list is England. Struggled past Switzerland at Wembley. Kane now has 49 goals in 68 games in an England shirt. One more than Lineker and level with Sir Bobby Charlton. That told early on as Southgate watched his five-man defence struggle with Walker Peters and Shaw. Never high enough to influence a counter-attack. England began the second half more direct and with more purpose, Gallagher slipping Kane down the right but Jonas Omlin met him well. Kane finally got his chance to jump above Lineker and he made no mistake from the spot in the 78th minute. From Daily Mirror under the main headline of Josh Warrington stops Kiko Martinez to regain featherweight world title. Summary of headline article. Warrington started like a train and refused to slow down as he became a two-time world champion in front of his home fans in Leeds Josh Warrington erased 15 months of misery with a stunning performance to stop Kiko Martinez and win back his featherweight world title. Warrington dropped the champion in the opening round and continued to dominate until the fight was stopped in the seventh session. Image. P.A. P.A. But he was immediately in trouble when he was dumped on the canvas in the opening round. Martinez survived but was in trouble and Warrington continued his relentless pace in the second. Session as Martinez struggled to deal with his challenges opening salvo. Can Josh Warrington win a second world title? From Daily Express under the main headline of Manchester United star to Hith Chong robbed at knife point by masked gang. Summary of headline article. More info Manchester United youngster to Hith Chong was reportedly held at knife point as masked gang. Members broke into his home in a terrifying 3 a.m. raid. The Birmingham City Loney saw thousands of pounds worth of possessions stolen in the break in amid a string of similar incidents over the past few weeks. Three masked men reportedly broke into Chong's home while he was asleep at 3 a.m. on January 16. Having made 16 total appearances for the Red Devils, including 12 in a single season back in 2019-20. The winger was sent out on a third consecutive loan spell this campaign with Birmingham City. Tahith Chong was sent out to Birmingham City on loan this season. From Mail Online under the main headline of Arsenal ready to move for Man United's Marcus Rashford. This summer. Summary of headline article.
Arsenal will try to sign Manchester United forward Marcus Rashford this summer. According to reports, Arsenal are interested in signing Marcus Rashford in the upcoming summer transfer window Mikel. Arteta may lose out-of-contract duo Alexandre Lacazette and Eddie Nketiah this summer meanwhile. Arsenal also allowed former captain Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang to join Barcelona in January. Rashford has fallen out of favour in recent months at Old Trafford. Starting just three league matches since the turn of the year. Southgate subsequently vowed to meet with Rashford to try to help the 24-year-old to rediscover his best form. With the World Cup just eight months away, Rashford may decide that a change of scenery is needed to get his career back on track. From Daily Star under the main headline of Ericsson Nets' superb goal with very first touch on. Emotional Denmark Comeback. Summary of headline article. For the latest from the pitch sign up for our football newsletter Christian Eriksson made in. Emotional return to international duty with Denmark on Saturday. And marked it by bagging a stunning goal with his very first touch. Eriksson collapsed during his last appearance with Denmark. Back in their Euro 2020 opener in June. Bergwijn netted his second in the 71st minute to put the game beyond Denmark. But few will bat an eyelid at the result in the wake of Eriksson's stunning international return. Just months after his Denmark career looked all but over. Prior to his return, Eriksson insisted that he was ready to close the chapter on his Euros nightmare by making a triumphant return to the Denmark fold. From the Sun under the main headline of Joe Root captaincy hanging by a thread with England on brink of West Indies loss. Summary of headline article. Joe Root's job as captain is hanging by a thread as England plunged to the brink of defeat in the Caribbean. It means England are certain to lose the series in the Caribbean after the first two tests were drawn. Ex-skipper Vaughan summed it up. The resilience in this England team is non-existent. When you continually see England collapse and show no fight, spirit or togetherness, I hear all the time that England are tight and have a good spirit. To see the England team capitulate without any spirit or fight, I'm afraid there are big questions to ask. England were puerile in the field and then produced another calamitous batting collapse. From Sky Sports under the main headline of Daniel Medvedev defeats Andy Murray at the Miami Open. Summary of headline article. Please use Chrome browser for a more accessible video player. From Daily Mirror under the main headline of Mason Mount admits concerns about Chelsea's future. Amid ownership uncertainty. Summary of headline article. At the beginning. And even now. We don't really know where it's going and what's happening the next day. But we focus on our football and what we can do is try and win as many games as we can. And Mount believes footballers should be prepared to offer their views on world events beyond the touchline. And Mount added, it can sometimes be hard to focus on football when a lot of things is going on around you. You don't know what's going on from day to day. So to focus on football is all we can do. From Metro under the main headline of Gareth Southgate warns Chelsea over, vulnerable. Gallagher Mount Partnership. Summary of headline article. The duo lined up in midfield together in England's win over Switzerland. Pictures. Getty. Gareth Southgate has praised Chelsea lone star Connor Gallagher after he made his England debut on. Saturday. Though says his partnership with Mason Mount left the three Lions vulnerable and necessitated a tactical switch. We feel that Mount and Gallagher are very good at pressing and are two attacking 8s, Southgate. Told Sky Sports after the match. I think he can set the tone for the rest of the team. We see that with his club every week. 
some players get close to people and don't actually win the ball. He goes and he makes contact and he turns a lot of ball over. Many thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the bell to get your daily notifications. Have a great day. Thank you for your support. Goodbye.